The largest part of the estate worth somewhere between 62 million and 144 million dollars is a 7,000 acre ranch that runs from the Inter American Highway to the Pacific Ocean with three miles of beach on the Pacific Ocean with plans there for two years to build a three billion dollar development. It's, it's the it's only one hour's drive from Panama City, and it's the last piece of any size like this. Well, what they did, all of which is illegal, all right, is the family took 36 fishermen, and they had the fishermen, and they gave each fisherman a piece of paper showing the lot that they supposedly lived on on the beach of this property for the last four years. They took the 36 fishermen, led them to the mayor's office of the local town who had no authority, and the mayor said, yes, you have possession of these 36 lots on the beach, all right? Then each fisherman sold his lot for a dollar an acre to a single corporation that nobody knows quite who owns it, all right? So that now, on this beautiful piece of property that everything was going to, marina, casino, everything centered on around the Pacific, okay? And then behind it, residential technical schools for the kids to, to you know, all that stuff destroyed because some, quote, unknown person was able to get a hundred acres of beachfront property there while nobody was able to stop it.